It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest ISO God of all time. Make sure y'all subscribe if you know. Hit that like button, help a brother get recommended, and hit the goddamn bell, man. Now look, apparently, we are going to have multiple parks in NBA 2K21 next gen, man. The reason I say this is because apparently somebody DM me some pictures a few days ago and like it was just it just said everything that just got leaked yesterday by the way i broke it down yesterday's video broke down all that build shit you know best breakdown news nigga in the in the in this shit so go check it out man broke down the ins and the outs and what to expect in next gen so almost everything he said that was leaked that sounded crazy it happened it, like that, that's what they leaked uh, this 24 takeover shit all this other stuff no pie charts like like it like it seems so unrealistic but it was true and on this list they saying we gonna have multiple parks and all other type of shit man so let me go ahead and read it off check it off y'all y'all let me know how y'all feel about it so first they say Badges have been changed where you have to do things of the badge, aka flashy passer, means you'll have to do flashy passes, right? Um, I don't know if they said that in the article. Y'all, y'all let me know down below. But then they also said ankle stabilizer badges added for big men. They actually added that. I'm like, what the fuck? Who who would think of that? Like he clearly knows something. Or whoever's I'm lost as shit. Now, I don't know why they're making an ankle stabilizer badge when there's literally no takeover that breaks ankles. Now, maybe for some reason they finally buffed ankle breakers to where everybody's ankles is going crazy. And since it's since he's saying that it's specified for big men, maybe it's way easier to break big men's ankles, which is nice. I like that, man. It's, it's a fucking basketball game. So hopefully they just don't have this badge and um, there's already no ankles to begin with and now there's super no ankles. Hopefully the whole system is rewrote because I'm still thinking with hands up defense in 21, you can't break ankles. Hopefully niggas can't hold they nuts anymore. Bro, we on next gen. If niggas can't hold they, mutts, they nuts and not get in the ankle breaker animation, I'm gonna be highly fucking pissed, you know? Like, God damn, nigga, years! <laughs> Since 14, years! <laughs> we, not, we not talking, years, nigga, years, bro, come on, man. Like, I'm tired of niggas holding their dick, they know I'm streaming, they know I'm Swante, oh, ankle breaker. Like, come on, bro, they don't they want to play defense. They just don't want <laughs> no ankle breaker. They don't even care if I score, it's so trash, bro. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about that that particular thing, man. <clears throat> and they say four new badges for each category that separates bigs, small forwards, and guards. Um, I don't think they specified that. So, uh, I don't know. I don't know what the hell the badges is going to be. Maybe they limit certain badges. Y'all y'all give me y'all's um thoughts on what badges they could possibly try to create a gap, man. Um... Hmm, I, I, I can't, man, maybe like some type of angle. I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully that creates more balance and niggas just can't do everything. Um, There's like a reason to make smaller guards and bigger guards, shit like that. No lateral quickness attribute anymore. Um, I don't know why this is removed or whatever. Maybe they're just gonna make everyone faster because defense is just trash. I don't know. Maybe it has to do with speed. I don't know. Now look, here here's the here's the here's the thing. Here's the thing. Multiple parks announced including overseas parks in Asia. Now look, in this list almost everything has come true. Why would they be lying about this, right? Hopefully there is multiple parks and shit. Y'all let me drop a like if you want multiple parks and if you think this is true. I mean, the only thing is, bro, they have to take out the cages. They got to take out all these damn stores, bro. I don't think they going to do that shit. They got to penalize niggas from running, figure out if it's the hiding rep, the man, 
when people squad up man it should teleport people to the next nearby match so they don't pick and choose bro like I, I i don't know bro like like bro it had like something has to happen bro because niggas just run it's fucking annoying if you run in this if you run from games you're fucking garbage my nigga you're a waste of human space i don't care if you don't want to play try hards blah 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 dude at least play them once play them once experience it it'll make you better i promise you what doesn't kill you makes you stronger if you can learn how to hang with better people cheesier people at least play once don't just run niggas walking off of streaks y'all be worrying about your win percent when your win percent is fucking trash bro who cares earn your win percent bro y'all need to have a better mentality bro you 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 really you really bought a game to just run away from people pick and choose like bro you're gonna look back on life like what was i doing bro like bro that, that's that pushy shit man you have to change your mentality as a human being face niggas test yourself look for improvement ways to improve yourself stop all this goddamn pussy footing through life if you a bitch on a video game what is you gonna be in real life in real situations get it together i'm over here going court to court to court five six niggas walking up like what nigga get your game up take some l's become better you know what I mean niggas i done trained that pulled up on me over and over again that i done beat they ass and now they decent players and they've even become youtubers or stage players all from the training of the swan the dojo of the swan you have some of your favorite youtubers been getting their ass whooped by swan years ago test yourself now here's another thing they leaking um this wasn't specified have to play my career before entering the park um that's kind of stupid i heard like uh you have to play games or something i i don't know man hopefully it's not like on every player and shit <clears throat> I don't know wait what this this does make sense this does make sense because they don't want everyone getting on the game and then complaining about missing all this shit and so that does that's a brilliant marketing strategy brilliant 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 because here's why it's a bad look saying oh we miss we're missing we're missing and the whole time niggas don't have their badges but they're still bitching and tweeting at 2k everyone celebs and stuff now if they force you to play my career you know brilliant whoever thought of that you brilliant for the business side i don't like that because you know i want to hit that big court you know i, I just want to go show y'all and um yeah man but i think that's brilliant y'all let me know how y'all feel about it for for the 2k i know y'all probably don't like it but well maybe overall it's better because then mike wang ain't pressured to change the uh shooting so hey and then they say three new takeover bars have been added regular double and team and this is true this is true y'all let me know how y'all feel about the y'all let me know how y'all feel about the takeover system um i'm thinking i might like it bro because if they're splitting takeovers right if they're splitting takeovers that means they're trying to low-key nerf takeovers because takeovers are definitely way overpowered and in 19 they was just fucking toxic bro they lasted way too long so hopefully with this double takeover they're trying to like market it like that and um yeah if y'all ain't picked up it's like 24 new takeovers i guess for kobe or whatever i don't know if y'all picked up on that just letting you know but yeah like it's like like shot creator like they're splitting it so i don't know i like that more like if takeovers are nerfed right so to where like niggas aren't unstoppable i know some of y'all probably don't like it but in the right hands takeovers are just like broken bro so like if you have to double up I, I don't know i think it's cool um hopefully when niggas get team takeover it just don't turn into fucking space jam and niggas is just gods i don't know <laughs> y'all let me know how y'all think the whole takeover system will play out and um yeah they also leak builds will have caps based on position weight and wingspan and this was true they showed this so this is why i think multiple parks is coming back hey and then they say pie charts have been removed entire new system and all all, all this was true man y'all rate all the news that came out yesterday down below one through ten 
Let me know how y'all feel about next gen coming out. If you're excited, if you're getting it, or if you can't afford it, you know. But um, yeah, man, y'all let me know if y'all think New Parks is coming out, all that other BU shit. I'm out this hoe. Follow me on Twitch. I'm going to stream um, on Twitch tonight. Ice with some niggas. Roll some niggas up in game chat. Make sure y'all like the video. Subscribe if you new. Turn on post notice. Check out my last video where I broke down the builds and all that other news. And um, the whole blog. And yeah, I'm out this hoe.